Assalamu alaikum. How are you children? I hope all of you are doing well and doing your work, school work, okay? Now, yesterday or the other day maybe, we have uh, learned about noun, common and common noun. I hope you do, you learn their definitions because I'm going to ask you later on, okay? And then we also compare, we, we see the difference between proper noun and common noun, okay? So today, we're going to talk about verb. We have also discussed this one during your physical classes in the two weeks. And even though when you were in the lower class, like you, you were in prep grade two, now you're in grade three, but... Uh, since grade one, you have been learning this one, okay? Now, okay. Now, verb, everyone knows, is an action words or doing words, okay? So, action, koi bi kam o action, okay? Now, we're going to have a game. But before the game, I want you to know the objectives of our The students... You, the students, okay? You will be able to recognize the action word in a sentence or you'll be able to identify the verb in a sentence. Okay, you don't know. I have just changed. I have just changed. Okay? Now, let's first have a game. Now, as you're sitting there, read one by one. This The game is Simon Says, Okay? What is the name of the game? Simon Says. Okay? Simon Says game. Whatever is written there, just read it and then just read it and then you have to do it. Like, for example, close your eyes. Now, everyone should close their eyes. Okay? So, that is. And then next to it, Simon Says, raise your hands. Raise your heads. So, start to start to Okay, good. Now, Simon says, sleep on the table. Jaldi, jaldi. Sleep on the table. Kaha bhi ho? Table mein so jau. Okay, let jau. Now, the other one is, Simon says, stand up. Oh, very good. Stand up, stand up. Now, Simon says, your eyes are closed. Ne, ne, ne? Open your eyes now. Open your eyes. Good. Simon says, Sit down. Good. Now, Simon says, listen to the teacher. Okay? Good. Now, let's take a look at the action words or the verb in our other slides because the last uh, Simon says, he told us to listen. He told you to listen to me. Okay? Simon says, listen to the teacher. Okay, everybody? Listen, focus. Okay, look at the slide. What is written? What is written? The fish swim in the sea. If you're going to look at the swim, that shows action. So that is the verb. Okay, next slide. The choir sing beautifully. What is that? The choir. C-H-O-I-R. Choir. That's the correct uh, pronunciation of that word. The choir sing beautifully. Okay. Next slide, next slide is, let's see. So, in the choir sing beautifully, which one is the verb? Very good. Yes. Sing is the verb. Siren is chatting on the phone. Which, uh, which word shows action in that one? Siren is chatting on the phone. Uh-huh, tell me. Okay, yes, chatting is the verb. Now in our seventh slide, 
Now, in our seventh slide, I want you to tell me if all the things in this slide, if you can do it. Because this girl here, she said that below are some of the things that I can do. And they are all verbs. Okay? The girl can jump. She can play. She can swim. She can skip. She can argue, she can sleep, she can think, she can smile, oh, she's worried, and also she can. Can you just tell me what else can you do aside from this one? Okay, you need to write down in your copy the things that you can do, all the verbs that you can do. Kitunabio, okay? Okay? And of course, Amara, each slide me home assignment. Tiga? Amara home assignment he, uh, nine, uh, slide 9 me he, grade 1 me. Agar up check karo, uh, 9 slide me underline the verb, question 1. There are, uh, there is only one slide, but agar uh, alag alag ka, uh, worksheet to there. Tiga? And then grade two, it's written that circle the verb with the similar meaning. Similar, like walk, stroll, open, drive. Tiga? Awo wala similar meaning sa walk sa wa up circle karo. Disappear. Kung sa wala disappear, matlab gum. Argue, speak, vanish. Okay. Now, the other one is run, dive, sprint, or ride. Uska sirf ek circle karna, har box mein ek circle karna hai, or wo uska similar meaning. Oh, grade 3 ke liye, for the grade 3, change the highlighted verb to, to a more interesting Also, the, the grade 2 homework because you see, it's disappeared to the uh, trio. It's a Imran disappeared from inside the haunted house. So, you disappear ka wo karo, uska synonym ka, similar meaning. Ka. The baby threw her teddy bear out of the room, the pram. Now, look at the true. Look at the true. What's the meaning of true? Peg dia. Okay? So, uska peg dia ka, kis, kis ne, uh, Konsa or zada interesting verb ap istamal kon konsa lab istamal kar sakti hai. Now, ek, number three is the stack of plates fell to the floor. Ha? Huh? Fell to the floor me. Konsa? Plates wala. Tur gya sab kuch. Ha? Ne? Agar giri gi to, agar sisha hai, to tur gya. Ap fell ka word ko, just uh, give me a more interesting verb in that one. Please help me. I said. Said ka matlab isne kaha tha. Mujhe madad karo. Okay? So, so, this is the homework. Grade 1, grade 2, and grade 3. Now, you have to do your homework. You have to write this one in your grammar copy. Okay? I hope you learned something. And if, and if you have any query, any question, Feel free to call us. Okay.